I just did, hello, I just did an article on um, the British monarchy and this group called the Republic that wants to take down the British monarchy and install dem democracy, full democracy. And it got me thinking. Firstly, England is a monarchy today, which is fucking weird because France and Germany both were like, eh, yeah, we've kind of had it with this dumbass thinking that they're like running everything. Now that we have technology to run the country ourselves, let's create a democracy. So they had their revolutions or just their, like Germany had a pretty, pretty seamless transfer of power. Although of course the chaos that ensued after that, but Oh, by the way, uh, so I just I just made a video. I always kind of find it annoying when people are like, I just made a video and there was no audio, so I'm making another one. You're like, okay, I didn't need to know that, but I did and I did. Um, you may have noticed these lights. So they're 10 bucks each on Amazon. Highly recommend looking for these. They're called War Moon. The hell calls their company War Moon. Uh, they come, each bulb comes with one of these. And dude, I mean, they're they're absolutely spectacular. They're so cool. And then they have different settings um, where they just shift and change on their own. There's like the flash, strobe, fade, and smooth. And I'm totally into this uh, this lighting thing. You can even you can make them dimmer. Not that I want to. I like them brighter. So I I've been turning them on for videos, and then I'll turn them off. And then once it starts to get dark, I'll use them again. Um, but I've noticed like how different colors make me feel different ways and red is really doing me right right now. It's like, um, I was put, I put it on the other night when I first got it, I put on red and Jeff was like, that's some first chakra shit, man. And I, I thought that was so funny, uh, because it, it made me uncomfortable being in the red. I was like, Oh, I don't know about this. This is weird. But then after a little while I started to settle and it's like a, this empowering creative energy. I get at night. I'll have like just all, it'll be red. Everything will be red. You know, the other night I was wearing a red shirt and red pants. I don't know if you can see them behind me. They're next to that box. I haven't thrown them in the laundry bag yet. So I was like in all red with my red lights on, learning Russian. Um, I think that our British friends need our help overcoming the monarchy and establishing democracy because it's like similar to like if you see your friend getting the shit kicked out of him and he's held down on the ground you're not like oh i'm gonna watch him get up and take control of the situation himself you gotta help and when i talk to my a lot of my friends in england or from england or britain and and talk about the queen and the monarchy they're kind of like you know there's you get the occasional person's like fuck that shit down with that let's do it but for the most part, I think they're, they're kind of like tentative about it because I think if you speak out against the queen really hardcore in England, that you might be calling down the thunder. And a lot of people are like, they don't want to be on the bad list because, uh, you know, the media will portray that they're just like these these fun, loving, bumbling fools that just hang out. But the reality is they have shitloads of money and they're constantly meddling in politics. So this organization called the Republic is like when Queen Elizabeth dies, we're establishing a democracy and this needs national and global mainstream attention because when england liberates itself the rest of the world's going to follow you know the english people this is like it's it's like our it's like i think as americans we have a duty to england it that, that it's you know we're the same fucking people uh, a few hundred years removed, but like, it's the same. It's just like a, obviously we're all the same people, but like we need to help them. So I think the best way to do that is just spread the word, spread the knowledge. And uh, I'll put a link to the article I just wrote about it. So you can take a look at Republic, which is this organization that's run by this fellow by the name of, what is it? Smith, I think, right? Not Bradley Smith. Graham Smith. He's the, the chief executive of Republic, and he, he's like full on been going on about it. But take a look at their website, get down with this, share the article, share the video, and make a video yourself with your thoughts on it because it's real important that we, we talk about this. It's To me, it's something that hasn't got a lot of like note, notoriety. I haven't talked a lot about it because in the back of my mind, I'm just like, yeah, whatever, they'll take care of it. But it's kind of like legalizing marijuana. Like if you don't 
go for it, which we should do legalize marijuana. It just takes a long time, you know, and then all these people that are suffering in jail from illegal marijuana, all these people in England that have to fucking worship the goddamn queen. Are you fucking kidding me? Yeah, it's time.